Well, I want to fax Mars, and this one is downright hilarious. I'm sitting here, I'm sitting here wondering what these people are smoking. Scientists hear voice of ancient humans in baboon calls. It's right there in black and white. It's from Big Story AP. Baboon grunts and meaning calls may hold secrets about human speech according to a new study suggesting that the origins of human language reach back as much as 25 million years. The barks, yaks, and wahoos of the guinea baboons reveal distinct human language <laughs> sounds according to the study published Wednesday by the journal Pius I by scientists from six universities in France and Alabama. The authors, led by Dr. Louis Jean Beau of Grenoble's Alps University, studied the acoustics of 1,335 baboon sounds in the animal's tongue anatomy. They cast doubt on theories that language developed only after the appearance of humanoids with low larynx. Instead, they say their research suggests that the human vocal system developed from abilities already present in the ancestors such as guinea baboon. So now, so now guinea baboon is a great great grandpappy or something. Unbelievable. They also found similar muscles in baboon tongues as human tongues which are key to our ability to make vowel sounds. Of course they got muscles in their tongues. So do dogs. What the hell does that mean? Language is a key difference between humans and the rest of the natural world, but the origin of our speech remains one of the greatest mysteries of science, scientists wrote. Oh boy. We learn to talk. All sorts of critters communicate by voice. But we didn't come from baboons. This is what Rush means when he says when cook liberals are in power, they're dangerous. When they're out of power, they're funny. And right here you have liberals who are out of power and they are funny. The evidence developed in this study does not support the hypothesis of the recent sudden and simultaneous appearance of language and speech in mon modern homo sapiens, study says. It suggests that human language evolved from ancient articulatory skills already present in our last common ancestor about 25 million years ago. Sorry. I'm not related to baboons. They're an animal. I'm a human. Screw you. The authors say the findings reveal a loose parallel between human vowels and baboon vocalizations produced in such communications as sounding alarm or calling to copulate. So, now, uh, I'm not going to go there. I guess sex is the same or something like Similar study in monkeys published last year also identified five vowel sounds suggesting a link to the origins of human language. These people are getting crazy. Uh, I remember doing, I did a video... That said that all human languages were uh, basically the same. Or related, I forget exactly what there was to it, but uh, these people are getting crazy. Similar study on monkeys published last year also identified five vowels suggesting a link to the origins of the human language. Professor Scott Moisek of the Max Planck Institute for Psycholin 
linguistics in the Netherlands was not involved in the new study, so its findings fit with all the research and its own experience listening to primates and zoos and online animal videos. When I hear a cat on YouTube, oh my god. When I hear a cat on YouTube produce a vocalization that sounds very much like Old Long Johnson or No 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 Cat or a dog that gets pretty darn close to imitating I love you and led to believe that to use the words of the Bowling Company speech precursors how however rudimentary or limited go back more further than 25 million years he said in an email to the AP <laughs> Oh my god. Um, yeah, you left something out, uh, Professor. You left out parrots and minor birds. He and colleagues, Dan D. 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 O. Know that balls are just part of the equation, calling for call for more research on tougher to make consonants. So there you have it. They're saying that uh, it's monkeys that taught us how to talk. They're crazy. They've just gone flat out nuts. Uh, you see, <laughs> critters do communicate, and I say they do, but they uh, don't have, you scientists, you have to understand something, they don't have the purpose the way we do. When we say, I'm going to go go out to the car for something, that would be meaningless to them. They do everything by instinct. We don't do everything by instinct. That's the difference, you scientists. This is just utter hogwash. No, I did not evolve for some goddamn monkey. I did not learn how to speak from some chimpanzee. Sheesh! Uh, some of you scientists really are ready for a box of crayons in a rubber room. I'm sorry. This, this is a new level of kookiness. Unbelievable. So, we learned to th talk from monkeys. Unbelievable. I'm Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching.